Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. When a customer overpays you or gives you a down payment or a prepayment, you record the amount that you received into the Receive Payments window. Doing this creates a credit for the customer or customer job that was specified. Later on, after you have created an invoice for the specific customer or customer job, you can return to the Receive Payments window to apply the credit to the customer's existing invoice. To apply an existing customer credit to an outstanding invoice within the Receive Payments window, select the name of the customer or customer job who had the outstanding invoice and the credit that you want to use. Then select the invoice against which you wish to apply the credit from the listing shown. Note that you should not attempt to place a check mark in front of the invoice as that indicates it's being paid. Instead, click anywhere else within the line of the invoice except for the check mark column to select the desired invoice against which you wish to apply the customer's existing credit. Once that's been accomplished, click the Discounts and Credits button in the main tab of the ribbon at the top of the window to open the Discount and Credits window. Here you should select the Credits tab if necessary in order to view any available customer credits. To imply the entire credit shown, simply click the checkmark column next to the credit shown in the Available Credits section if necessary to select it. The amount shown will be displayed in the Amount to Use column within this window. Also note that to apply a partial credit amount, you can change the amount of credit that's applied by changing the amount shown in the Amount to Use column if needed. Once you've entered the amount of credit to apply, simply click the Done button to apply the credit amount indicated to the selected invoice and return to the Receive Payments window. Now if you continue to receive payment by marking the invoice, you should also see the credit amount appear at the bottom in the Discount and Credits Applied section at the bottom of the window. You can then finish receiving the customer payment as needed within the Receive Payments window. Now when you're finished, click either the Save and Close or Save and New buttons to save the transaction window and either close the window or clear the window, leaving it open for additional transactions. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.